On the first day of Christmas my true love gave to me A partridge in a pear tree On the second day of Christmas my true love gave to me Two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree On the third day of Christmas my true love gave to me Hey guys, it's Lisa, and today I am back to do a, another Ipsy and Zip. So, I didn't think I was ever going to get my Ipsy this month. Everybody else that I know that has it had already gotten it, and it took forever for mine to come. But boy, was I excited when I got it. So, I've gotten the bag, and I've used the products. I'm actually wearing all of the products today. First off, this bag. I mean, come on. It has everything so it's furry and it's like this pinkish red it actually double as a clutch um it's got the little ipsy emblem on it the clutch um wristlet so cute i love it so when you open up the bag there's all kinds of goodness inside so the first thing that i have is this ofra bliss eyeshadow highlighter so I've gotten I've gotten an Ofra product from them before. First off, that first pan was half this size. It was a different color, um, but I love this just the same as I did the other. It's very pigmented. It's what I have on my eyelids. I foiled that on um, my eyelids, and the rest of my eyes is um, from the Graveyard Girl palette that she done with Tarte. I love, and I'm so excited. And I will be doing some makeup views on it. But that's a swatch, um, or what the finger dip looks like. And there is the swatch. It is beautiful. Of course, it's the familiar Ofra um, um, feel. It's very buttery. goes on very smooth. I've been wearing this eyeshadow since about 6.30 this morning. And um, it's now 1.30. And it's still looking good, holding strong. So I can't complain about that. So I'm very excited about this. Um, the next thing that I got was this um, lippy that I'm wearing. And it's the Tardiest Glossy Lip Paint. WCW is what it says on the bottom as far as the color. Um, it's a nice berry color. It matches my shirt. Um, it is uh, really nice for Christmas. I like the feel of it. It is very glossy because, of course, it is a gloss. But it feels really good. And overall, I just like the way it feels. Um, of course, it doesn't. It wears pretty long for a gloss, but it's not um, an all-day lasting type situation. The next thing I got was... A angled brush from Royal and Lang Nickel. It's an angle shader. I used it to apply um, the color in my crease today and it worked very well. Um, I think that this brush will become a favorite very easily. The next two things uh, I can take or leave. So, this is the Moisture Rich Hydrating Jersey Shore Cosmetic Peppermint Lip Balm. Um, I don't know much about this uh, product or the Jersey Cosmetic line. It's good. I mean, it's like any standard lip balm. Nothing major. Uh, for those of you who know me, you know that I am a chapstickaholic. Um, so, I do own a lot of different brands. But... I mean, there's nothing that stands out about this one that I could say, you know, oh, go buy this over ChapStick um, because there wasn't really anything. The next thing was this Moonlight Primer that I got. I mean, as far as a primer, it holding your makeup, I feel like it did. Um, it didn't fill in or um, smooth out any texture or anything like that. Don't really know that it claims to. It just claims to moisture and moisturize and prime. The weird thing I thought was um, the color of it. It comes out of the tube black. So that's very weird. But of course, when you smooth it on your skin, it smooths out clear. 
It doesn't really have a smell to it. Um, but for your standard primer to help your makeup stick, I feel like it does the job. Do I think that I would ever purchase any of it? I mean, I'm not going to go out of my way to purchase it. But I will use this. I'm always glad to get a primer. I'm always glad to use new products. But overall, three out of five products out of this Ipsy bag um, being as good as they were isn't bad. Very excited. I always love my Ipsy bag. I've been thinking about um, also doing um, BoxyCharm or Birchbox. So um, you guys leave me a comment below maybe if you get those boxes. What you think about them. Which one I should get over the other. Glossy Box, Boxy Charm. If I should add Birchbox onto this one. Um, or if you guys would like to see that, um, leave, me, leave me a comment below. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if you like it. That helps me out a lot. Also, don't forget to subscribe. And once you do subscribe, hit that little bell right next to the subscribe box. That lets you know when I um, upload new videos. I know I've been slacking on the videos here lately. I've just not really been in it. I think with the holidays being busy and getting all that stuff done kind of led me astray, um, but I will be coming back strong. I've got some new things that I'm going to be telling you guys over the next couple of weeks, so I think those are exciting, so if you keep on coming back, you're going to hear some new things, and I'm finally going to open up and tell you guys a little bit about my backstory, and um, I know some of you have wondered, you know, what's happened with my neck, and you know just what my story is and so I've decided to open up and share that with you guys so that's coming up pretty soon so just stay tuned I've got a lot of good changes and a lot of fun stuff coming and I hope you guys stick around for it so I hope you enjoy the rest of your week and have a safe and blessed day and God bless and on the first day of Christmas my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree on the second day of Christmas, my true love gave to me Two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree On the third day of Christmas, my true love gave to me